This is a song I wrote called Just Let Love. Love is what makes men great, but we let ourselves be controlled by hate. Let God's love show you the way, and your love will shine brighter each day. To fight, two wrongs don't make a right. Love is what we all need. Come, my friends, let's plant the seeds of love. Just let love into your soul, let it, let it in. Just let love into your soul, let it, let it in. Just let love into your soul, let it, let it in. Just let love into your soul, let it, let it in. Just la 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 This is called Acts of Amendment. Change dapples across the foundation of integrity. Souls gasp for the breath of righteousness. Fuchsia takes hold, staring into the heart of conveyed truth. Our souls need rebraiding. We must weave ourselves into the mercy of the Father. Our wounds will be bound with the love of the absolute. Hate will become a foregone suicide, no longer a choice. Justice will soak to the bone. While, bl while blistered tongues are soothed in prayer. We must become intimate with the Master's wisdom as the flowers of understanding bloom in the eternal footprints of patience. This poem is called Beloved. It began with the Eternal One, light in all darkness. He was known as the one of many names. We shall call him Father. And the Eternal One created another, Beginning with a seed, he nurtured and cared for it. The seed began to grow, ever childlike and innocent, a point of light in deep, dark space. He was known as the giver of all names. We shall call him Son. And so Father and Son created another, one of infinite grace, beauty, and magnificence, light to shut out all darkness. She was known as the breath giver. We shall call her mother. Singing the sweet melodies of song, this trinity joined hands and danced the universes into being, interdependent, weaving through time, bonded with love. Then they created souls to fill the vast worlds of time and space, mortals to walk the ever-changing planets, to traverse the stars, and to see the face of their maker. Each soul created brought forth an individual beauty with a purpose and destined to perfection. Recognizing the eternal truth and love of this divine trinity, and each soul 
with a free will choice, a choice to serve, to walk for their beloved creator into the eternity of time and the light of infinity. This next poem I wrote, it's called Overcoming. Embrace the question, absorb the answer. Give, do not take unless you are bereft. You cannot fall, for you have already fallen, so you must rise, but rise with a vision. Find trust and show respect. Overcome the answer with submission. Learn to your fullest, return a humble voice. Your pride is what blinds you, your faith is what guides you. Dark is below, light is above. Overcome your weaknesses, augment your strengths and dirty your knees in prayer to the Father. <laughs>